Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to a new episode of our series, Common Mistakes in Ramadan. Among the common mistakes that I have noticed in Ramadan, whenever I break my fast in the masjid with the community or somebody invited me at home, at their houses, um, or even when I uh, host some people at my house, um, what happened often, of us as a family as well, you know, when we break our fast, often when the time of iftar comes, we became so distracted by, so by eating and so happy to meet each other as we talk. I know, in Nabi Sallallahu told us that al-mu'min have two joys, the time of breaking their fast and the time when they meet Allah Subh'anaHu Wa Taala. So I know it's a moment of joy, a moment of happiness, everybody want to eat. But don't forget to utilize these few minutes in making a lot of dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Because the Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, as Imam Ahmad reported in his musnad, thalathu da'awatin la turad. Three du'as will never uh, uh, be uh, held back or it will be uh, accepted by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And among them, the person who making dua while fasting, and also there is another narration, upon breaking the fast. So while you are fasting during the day, but also upon breaking the uh, fast. So this is a time of, uh, a, a very important time for you to take advantage to make dua. But don't be distracted with dua from iftar. But while you are eating or before you break your, before you break your fast, like before adhan, the few minutes before adhan, and uh, while you are eating your uh, um, iftar, make sure that you uh, pray and you ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for yourself uh, and for your family. Or maybe after you break your fast with the dates, you do few, you take few uh, uh, seconds, minutes, whatever, and to make dua, uh, so Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept from you your siyam, make dua for your family, and so forth. In Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam used to make dua upon iftar. Himself, while he's eating, he would say, ذَهَبَ الظَّمَأْ وَابْتَلَّتُ الْعُرُوقُ وَثَبَتَ الْأَجْرُ إِنْ شَاءَ اللَّهِ As Imam Abu Dawood rahimahullah reported in his uh, Sunan. So that's just a good reminder for all of us to take advantage of every night of Ramadan when Maghrib is called, is to break your fast, but also make sure that you pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the goodness for yourself and your family and for all of us. Wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi Subscribe to this channel, share this video, and click on the bell icon so that you can be notified with every new video at Faith IQ. Jazakumullah khairan. Wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi